The MCAD co-designer extension allows you to edit the layout of a RigidFlex PCB from the mechanical side. Before you start, push your PCB to the mechanical engineer through the MCAD co-designer panel and place it as part of the device assembly. Co-designer allows you to place components in separate rigid regions that are defined on the PCB. The names of these regions correspond to the same PCB regions in Ultium Designer. Let's place one connector in the enclosure cutout and move the second component to another rigid region of the board. Best practices dictate what we call the universal or holistic approach to moving and placing components on the PCB. First, you need to find the desired components in the design tree of the rigid region in which it was originally placed. Then you should move that component to the appropriate location with respect to the enclosure. In this case, the end of the connector should be flush with the enclosure. After that, you can use mates to fine-tune the component's location until it is in the right position in the assembly. When a component is placed, delete all the previously defined mates for that component to prevent any conflicts in subsequent steps. Now let's move the component from the first rigid region to the third rigid region. To do this, first, you should move the component to the correct face of the device enclosure in the same way as was done for the Molex connector. After that, you should create a mate between the bottom face of the 3D component model and the face of the desired PCB region. Also, with angular mating to a plane side, you can rotate the component to any desired angle if your design requires it. When you have completed the creation of all defining mates for a component, you need to delete them as shown before. You can quickly find all the component-specific mates under its corresponding subsection in the design tree. After removing all the mates, move the component in the assembly tree to its new position on the rigid region of the PCB. In addition to moving existing components, you can place components from the MCAD side. After the transfer, they will be automatically recognized and converted to a regular Altium Designer component if it is present on your server. In order for Altium Designer to be able to successfully recognize a component, its 3D model must be geometrically identical to the 3D model of a component in the Altium Designer library. After placement in the assembly, place it on the appropriate rigid region of the board. When you have finished moving and placing components, push the PCB to the electrical engineer for further work. In the MCAD co-designer panel, the electrical engineer sees a new notification and sees a list of changes. The adding of a new component that all team designer recognizes, moving two previously placed components, and a move to a new region for one of them. Note that after accepting the changes, the newly placed component is automatically added with the corresponding footprint. The overall positions of all components correspond to the positions that the mechanical engineer specified for the external mechanical CAD tool, outside of Altium Designer.